so this is hyper os this is another hyper os modded edition if you are into some custom roms you don't want to leave miui or hyper os you don't want to use pixel based custom roms because of some reasons then you can try out xiaomi eu why so in this video i am going to talk about some great things about this custom rom which you should definitely check out let's get started and let's find out and one of the major differences you will find in some other hyper os and this one is in this modded hyper os edition the safety net basically the device integrity is always passing and in case if the device integrity starts to fail they have their own patch available which you can try out on this one without root and definitely it's worthy so you might not get any banking gaps issues and that is just super amazing that is one of the major highlights of using this custom room don't using this custom room so don't miss it at any cost another one is regarding updater the best thing is unlike some other modded hyper os editions that this is actually updatable this also brings you some very useful things regarding in updater section which means you have the option to choose if you have twrp installed or not and it also helps you to update this hyperos edition through fast boot this is so amazing and not every hyperos modded edition brings you these kind of very useful features it's not always about some customizations in these hyperos modded roms but the good thing is these things are super useful and these things are included in this case you can use hyperos modded edition explore all the hyperos features which you have by default xiaomi eu is just one of the best options right now another one is in the theming section because we are using a modded edition of hyperos which means theme store also matters unlike in some other modded editions which are based on china the theme store is in chinese language but in this case it's actually english language and also it brings you import themes options so if you have an mtz file if you have any mtz file available which you can try out as a theme you can definitely do, do that in this hyperos modded edition like in some of the themes which i found in hyperos those themes are not present in the theme store by default so yes the good thing is you can import those themes when in mtz format so you can apply them on a device sometimes what i found in this case is some themes take some times to load some time to load that might be because my internet connection is not so fast but the thing is these themes are actually in english language the names at least are in english language so the good thing is and of course in china themes are so good as compared to in indian or global hyperos or modded or any kind of miui edition so that is also one of the advantages of using this custom rom also because this is xiaomi eu as i just mentioned it is not bringing you any kind of major customizations but only useful things like notification history is enabled by default in case you don't know hyperos does not brings you this avsp kind of feature by default included but in hyperos modded edition basically xiaomi eu it brings you the option of notification history but including that all the useful things you also have the option to switch the control center side and that thing is present here just below as you can see we also have some options to enable or disable some status bar icons and if i switch the control center side which is also kind of useful in some cases as you can see you can switch the control center side you can get the control center from the left side left top instead of right top which is by default so yes the options are present here for you to customize to enable any feature you need and it's not a feature based it's, it's not a customization focused modded edition if you need some customizations then you can try out some other modded editions of hyperos because it's hyperos it's updated so all the lock screen options are present in my case i'm using poco f5 as an example unfortunately xiaomi u is not present for a lot of devices at least from some time only for the few of the devices especially if your device is based on china then you might get hyperos update especially if you are using a flagship xiaomi device then it's a definitely worthy check out but we already have a lot of modded editions of hyperos available you can check them out in case you want to other than else all the security features of course not kind of security features but some features some people love these kind of features on their devices those are already present in xiaomi eu in this update too so yes these are the things present here if you want to try it out on a device as just mentioned it is available for only few of the xiaomi devices at least while making this video if you need link links are already available in the description thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one until then take care and make sure to subscribe the channel to see the upcoming videos thanks for watching